We're out here I'm with Ish Monroe. We're fishing for ling cod in 150 to about 200 foot of water. Ah! Oh! Oh, we got him! Oh! Rose! You know, we continue to catch these things and we're really weeding them out. You know, we're catching so many now that the only ones we're gonna keep are that nice middle of the road size fish. You know, eight to 12 pound fish are the ones we're gonna keep. And the limit is six. You know, at this point, we've got four in the box and we need two more good ones. What a bite that was. Oh, you got it again. That was like a better one. Yeah. And this time, Ish has got something on that feels good. I saw that bite, that bite was crazy. Yeah. And then he, he gets it up, he's like, no, nah, no, it's just, just the medium size, average size fish. And he swings it in. And I'm not even paying attention because that's not a big one. And all of a sudden I hear Ish get excited. C come up here, you gotta, you gotta see this. I'm like, what, what, what's going on? And he's like, he's got an octopus down his throat. And I'm like, cool. Sure enough, I see it, tentacle. I get the pliers and I pull it out. It is it, an octopus. Yeah. Oh my God. Use it for bait. Oh. I'm, I'm dead serious. Put that on Look your, at that. Put that on your jig head. Mike. You need to put the octopus on. I'm like, the octopus? And he thinks, I know he thinks I'm joking. He's going, with the swim bait? I'm like, trust me. And I'm like, what, you know, what's the deal? He's like, man, that is the best bait you can use to catch a big lingcod. He's got an opportunity catching a 20 plus pound freaking lingcod. It's a, hold on a second. I want everybody at home, folks at home to see this. And I'm leaning down to like grab the octopus and I get this bite. Look at this, I'm so good. And you got one. I got, I got, I got, I got, He's I got, got one. I got him. Falling. But there's an the octopus, octopus near my crotch. There's an octopus near my crotch though. No. Stay over there, I you octopus. Like I got a good one. I'm down. I'm down. You stay over there. Don't you get me in my crotch. Baby. Yeah. Blue one and octopus. And I'm hooking it directly on the jig head of the same swim bait I'm throwing. Part swim bait. Part octopus. Come on, let's go. I'm like, we're getting ready, we're gonna get lined up, we're gonna get on the juice, and it's gonna happen. But I still don't believe that something's gonna hit a freaking dead octopus on a jig head. Mike's gonna basically toss it out there, let it swim on the bottom, and hopefully he doesn't farm him when he hooks up, but most likely he's set up for a big one. I drop it down, I'm like, okay, maybe, maybe this is a practical joke. I don't know if he's kidding or he's serious. I drop it down, I let it get to the bottom. Dude, I mean, it's down there 10 seconds. And I think he might have hopped it like once, and all of a sudden the rod just loads. Uh oh. Got him one bit. One bit. Got him. Good one. That's yeah. a good one. Told you. That's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. Take your time, Mike. That's a big one. And when I set the hook on this one, I instantly know that this one is a different animal. Oh my God. It's a big one. Bro. It's real. Don't pump him. Real. Oh God! Oh, this is a different, this is a different animal, bro. I told you, it's a big one. Oh, chicken puss, stay on there. Right. I can't. I'm not even turning them, man. Well, oh, sorry. Look at that thing. Here you go, Mike. I freak out. Yeah! 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 Chicken puss. Yeah, you got the puss. Make Look at that. that it's the biggest ling cod I've ever caught in my life. That's what it's all about, right there, man. Look at that. Saltwater fishing with Ish Monroe. The king of bass fishing, the king of frog fishing is also the king of lingcod. Look at that thing. Bro. Mm. Jig and puss equals giant lingcod. And I caught it on a jig and puss. A jig and puss. That's number five for us in the box. Stop rocking till I retire!